Gumawa kami ng video concluding that 650 watts is good enough for most high-end rigs. Pero maraming tao nag-comment saying na para nakukulangan sila, gusto pa nila nung headroom. Allowance ba kamo for that future GPU in your life? Headroom for that hot, hot, hot CPU coming soon. This video is for you. Magre-review tayo ng 1000 watt PSU from Deepcool, the PQ1000M. Siguro kahit anong computer needs mo, sapat na to. Bibili ka ng PC, gusto na hindi kailangan ng Windows. Pero saan ko kukuha ng legit Windows? Daming options, daming prices. Akal ito. Buti na lang, may cdkeyoffers.com. Madali lang ang order. Search for the software you need. Add to cart. Daan ka sa payment options nila. Wala pang 5 minutes. Finished! May legit working CD key ka na para sa Windows mo. Gamitin ng aming code para makakuha pa ng discounts. Kaya kung naghahanap ka ng legit, mura, at original software, Check out cdkeyoffers.com What's up, Internet? Unang-una, pinadala ni Deepcool sa amin tong item na to for review, but they had no say in what we had to say about it. Usually, I look for three things when it comes to a PSU. 80 plus rating, reliability, and manufacturer's warranty. Yung una, 80 plus rating. 80 plus is a third-party accreditation as to how efficient a PSU is. So actually, hindi talaga niya sinusukat yung quality or reliability ng isang PSU. The higher the color on the 80 plus scale, the more efficient it is. Mas maliit yung wastage ng kuryente na nakukuha niya dun sa outlet at yung napapadala niya directly to the computer. The higher its 80 plus color, the more efficient it is. So for example, mas efficient si 80 plus titanium kaysa sa 80 plus bronze. Hindi nga siya rating of quality, but because you need better parts para maabot mo yung efficiency rating na yun, naging stand-in na rin siya for quality. Generally, pag mas mataas yung 80 plus color, mas reliable din yung PSU. Itong Deepcool PQ1000M is rated 80 plus gold and this is the sweet spot for me, usually for enthusiasts as well. Lahat ng mga personal PSU ko at least 80 plus gold. Usually reliable yung gold. Number two, reputation. It's true may mga mas sikat na PSU manufacturers. But we've reviewed Deepcool PSUs before and we like them so much that we actually started stocking them in the shop. Kumbaga, we put our money where our mouth is. Sinasabi namin na maganda, kita naman namin na maganda, so binibenta na rin namin sa shop. In particular, the Deepcool 750 watt model, we always usually have on stock. And alam naman yung hardware sugar, no BS. If a product sucks, we'll really tell you. Since we do regularly stock Deepcool PSUs, marami na rin kami na benta, and so far, walang nagka problema in any of the units. So reputation wise, they have a really good track record with us. Number three, warranty. Kait anong brand, kait anong part, walang 100%. Inevitably, something will fail. Kaya mahalaga na pinagkakatiwalaan mo yung computer store mo. May no BS warranty ba sila? The PQ1000M has a 10-year warranty and that's quite good. Nasubukan ko na rin mag-claim sa PSU warranty from a different manufacturer. You can see my experience in the video above. A 10-year warranty is quite good. This might even outlive your current rig. Lipat mo lang siya to the next rig. And that's really what you want in a PSU na it should usually outlive the current parts of your computer. Magagamit mo pa sa next build mo. So for all of the three basic things I look for in a PSU, Pasado si PQ1000M. Isa pang hinahanap ng mga enthusiasts as a sign of quality is all Japanese capacitors. And all Japanese caps nga si PQ1000M, another sign na quality, reliable siya. It also has all of the usual protections, UPP, OVP, SCP, OTP, and OCP. Specs aside, how does it perform? We've had it in the shop for roughly around two months and <laughs> it has handled everything we've thrown at it. So lahat ng mga configurations na naisip namin, sinubukan namin, ginamit rin namin as a test bench, iba-ibang hardware configurations, no problem, it passed everything with flying colors. 1000 watts is really a lot of power. So realistically, for a proper stress test, we would need a mining rig or something. 
with an R9 5950X or an i9 12900K. We don't have that for our test bench, but we were able to try it with our fairly high-end setup, an R7 3700X with a 2080 Super, and it passed no problem. It handled all of the stress tests no problem. All of the parts of the PC were getting all of the power that they needed. As with most high-end cards, this is a fully modular PSU, so it's easier to do cable management, and everything is just much neater since ginagamit mo lang yung kailangan mo. There are no extraneous or unnecessary power connectors littering the setup. If you're rocking one of the higher-end RTX cards, you'll probably need at least three 8-pin power connectors. The PQ1000M does have that as well. At the end of the day, I'd give the PQ1000M 4 out of 5 stars. A good solid PSU from Deepcool at a good price. Just last note, you'll notice Gano siya kaliit compared to, well, ito 1,200 watts, ito 1,000 watts, pero ang liit pa rin niya compared to some other PSUs. A bit tiny actually, which, you know, is a good thing for a 1,000 watt PSU. The cables are just the flat plastic, not the braided type of some other premium PSUs. So there are little things, but at the end of the day, reliable siya. 1,000 watts, 80 plus gold, good price, solid offering from Deepcool. Ultimately, for a PSU, what you want to know is whether it has the performance it claims at kung tatagal siya. Dun sa performance ni PQ1000M, wala akong duda-duda. It will give you the power that you need. Yung longevity, hindi ko talaga masabi yun, but all signs so far are looking pretty good. Kung nakatulong tong video na to, we do have other videos explaining yung 80 plus rating, other review videos on PSUs that we've tried. Lahat yun nasa text description below. Thanks for watching. And thank you to our top fans. Na afford na namin tong upuan na to. De joke lang. Thank you to Leah Magnaye, Ian Meru, ITX Addict, John Ruben Ocha, Christian Espinosa, and Rafael James. Thank you for supporting the channel.